Make some noise, y'all, for our feature tonight, The Truth, The Poet! Who am I? I'm situation minus lie plus fact times reason equals me. I spit truth, discombobulate, and speak with frequency frequently. I'm the victim of slander, diminishing truth's worth. Finally found a real nigga but couldn't deal with her cause truth hurts. I said finally found a real nigga but couldn't deal with her cause truth hurts. Hurts like death, heals like resurrection, reveals like the outcome under pressure. My TL be treasured lessons, who am I? I am a conscious, often cautious. A contemplated abortion morphed into a bastard. A prime example of when DNA leaves you stranded. My Achilles heel be a double helix, fond of a foundation that withers me. Singled out to be more than just two sides to a story. See, I am an open book that's hard to read. My character be candid and candor, slow to anger, but contagious in laughter, with bruises that are hard to see. Cause I be broken with no fixing my halo, got a hole in it, my glass house got stones in it, and even though my soul's winning, I'm surrounded by people who contour faces just to beat me. But see, I'm so supernatural that God got me right the first time, so I wasn't present for the makeup. I'm the hundred that wouldn't sell out. Instead, I took a pay cut, so naturally they underestimate my worth. Therefore, going hard is the only way I stay up. See, I'm the one forced to take shots outside the building. Watching you niggas miss layups. See, I am persistent. Odds ain't gotta be fair for me to score first. So I be questioned like, who gon' top my cap when I be the goat all caps, fitted for a boss all snaps? See, I be fooled for thought, delivered by a higher power, all facts. That when God said a child would lead them, the universe already knew I would be the kid to be obedient to what he said. Because upon birth, a sign was given that my mission was to be so grounded that no one would bend that low to pick me. Plant a seed of a perspective that's interesting, one worth listening to, but hard to acknowledge. Plant with a love that has been forgotten and in an empty garden. Watch it bear fruit, then feed all of those who did, but most importantly didn't believe in you. Who am I? I said I'm situation minus lie plus fact times reason that it equals me. I spit truth, discombobulate and speak with frequency. Frequently, I'm the victim of slander, diminishing truth's worth. Finally found a real nigga but couldn't deal with her cause truth hurts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now we gonna get, we gonna get a little real, we gonna get real real quick, right? So, um, next step on this journey, depression. Um, how many people fake the funk? Yeah. Raise your hand, clap it up if you faked the funk before. You put on that face, that face like everything all right, and you not okay. All right, so this is, this is for all of us, for that moment. 
right? So it's, it got a little song to it. So if you if you feel it, sing along. For all my people who who in this audience who know it, you know y'all know to jump in, right? All right. So just follow my lead. I keep acting like the pain don't hurt. Like my soul ain't tied, knowing that the devil's heat couldn't dry my pillow at night. Nah, nah, but it's okay, cause the tears gonna come. And my spirit gonna cry. And my feet not gonna move forward sometimes. Times, times. I keep acting like the pain don't hurt, don't. Ah, like my soul ain't tied. Knowing that the devil's heat couldn't dry my pillow at night. Nah, nah, but it's okay, cause the tears gonna come, going, ah. And my spirit gonna cry. And my feet not gonna move forward sometimes. Times, times. See, this was me talking to myself in the mirror. Cause unhappy couldn't be more clearer with this fake smile. I'm only one more second from a breakdown, but I spend it saving others from their meltdown. You ever been suicidal? Saving everyone else from their demons while you still fighting the ones inside you? Preaching, telling someone else that they got so much to live for. But when it comes to yourself, you won't even know what you're here for. I guess it's a catch-22. That even though I couldn't live for me, I existed for the purpose of saving you. And to tell you the truth, see, I'm, I'm done with my selfless, my selfish wants to know who's going to come for me. Because, see, my soul is tied in entire need of love that requires some company. I mean, I mean, I'm exhausted trying to love myself enough for everybody. I'm exhausted trying to love myself enough for me. So sometimes I just sit and I spark a leaf for all those that fall every season but never leave. And I keep acting like the pain don't hurt, don't like my soul ain't tied, knowing that the devil's heat couldn't dry my pillow at night. Nah, nah, but it's okay, cause the tears gonna come. Ah, and my spirit gonna cry. And my feet not gonna move forward sometimes, times, times. I keep acting like the pain don't hurt, don't. Ah, like my soul ain't tied, knowing that the devil's heat couldn't dry my pillow at night. Nah, nah, but it's okay, cause the tears gonna come. Uh, and my spirit gonna cry and my feet not gonna move forward sometimes times times so be stronger for your strong friends have compassion for your weak friends and check on all the ones who all of a sudden went MIA because at the center of being broken there is always an okay in peace. All right. So that message, sometimes I do that at the end, but I don't want to leave on that note because in this journey, I got past that. You know what I'm saying? And so in your journey, you will get past that. The message here is that it's okay not to be okay. Okay? Let somebody know how you're feeling. That's the only way we can be helped. If you need a hug, say you need a hug. If you need a friend, say you need a friend. If you need a call, someone to talk to, allow yourself to be talked to because there are people here that want to help you. All right? And that's the only way we can heal. So that's that message for that. It's part of the journey. We still ready? Yeah. All right, all right. We about to change it. We about to change it. Let's talk about COVID. <laughs> the pandemic. How many people was a mess? How did that feel for you? Do we remember 2020? Do we remember March? Do we remember what happened in that year? Right? Who is over it? Over it. Okay. This is how the pandemic made me feel. Okay? My summer's been cold before, but as the world turns, some of them took a force majeure. Now viral been a virus and now COVID got you seeking cures or seeking voids to fill up what you lack inside. Desensitize feelings to leave your fears compromised. Change your weather been a thing that's kept us sick and tired. But who am I to address a misfit who is suited for more war than he is equipped with? When you're on the outs, you wear the mask that helps you fit in until your strength is acquired. A cold summer full of fallacies that nurtures the devil's desires. No coincidence or surprise that these are the most prophetic of times. 
But to the signs, we are not attentive. They hope we get lost in the dark while they flipping switches. Woke niggas claim to be aware of the agenda, but they scared of a pandemic that's a gimmick? You thinking corona, I'm thinking chemtrails been a chemist. Don't void that, my insomnia been a theorist. New laws and provisions full of contradictions. Global shutdown the same time as the census. Common sense says they gonna count them as they kill them. They change divide and conquer into social distance. To complete the mission, being savage is essential. 2020, and we still don't see it coming the way they distort our vision. See, God said we living in the final hour. And Satan told God, don't rush the challenge. I got him clock live and wired. Watch him tick tock until time expires. See, they neglect to survive while we scheme and conspire. And we're too distracted to panic when the madness transpires. It's crazy how this tactic is ancient dinosaur land before time. But I'm old school 80s, baby. Rafiki inspired. So I stay ready because a cold summer in my city don't ever cease fire. It's just a cold front from when the heat rises. So we stay vested, protected, making hearts hard to invest in. Lost stock and love a long time ago when real niggas is in a recession. So it's no secret we walk sleeveless and our shoulders are cold. So cold that forgiveness is non-existent and karma's out of commission because this cold summer got niggas too frozen to let it go. See, we was taught to play the hand we were dealt with a poker face that won't let it show. Whether we're tripping or geeking on a cold summer when we seen four seasons in a weekend. No shade, I'm surrounded by trees that stayed leaveless. It's been hard to breathe, but a respiratory pandemic that makes you block your main airway is beyond me. When the real gangster radiation out here is stealing life just like a thief on every block. I'm bothered, rate that nigga 5G. Every day I pray for peace in a world full of non-believers, but who would believe in Jesus when Judas doing the preaching? So it's cold, like misery and chill in the pits of hell. This world been sick of cells, lying in the hand of the wicked one that's only designed to let us fail. But I must still fight for mine, because I was taught that ups and downs give life to a flat line. So if I'ma be a faithful and discreet slave, I'ma be the one that supports the Lord's coming, having faith that he will change my cold summer into a cold running. All right, all right, all right. So I heard somebody say poets ain't got bars like that, yeah. How y'all feel about that? Poets got bars, right? Hella bars, right? So, so this is dedicated for the fool, whoever would say a poet ain't got no bars. All right? Are y'all ready to hear some bars? All right, so I, I want to feel like a battle rapper, all right? I like battle rap, you know what I'm saying? So, so can I hear y'all just say bars? Bars. bars? bars. All right. If y'all hear bars, I need y'all to just, if the bar's hitting you, just, just, there we go. Just like that. This, she got me. I love it. All right. So, God told me to treat the stage like it's my jungle gym. Only spit monkey bars. Guaranteed to hang on your every word. Word. God told me to treat the stage like it's my jungle gym. Only spit monkey bars. Guaranteed to hang on your every Word. 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 See, these are poetic bars. No punchlines, just prophetic sparring outside the ring. No need for battling, but just in case you want to battle me, understand that I'm lethal. And with no Vaseline, you'll get done with that ether. So, so until you boys grow up on that high and I'll be priesting, preaching how the streets are deceiving, leaving these Chuckies cheesing, but there'll never be a token child. Play playing this game will never give you tickets to a way out. Because once you're in, it's difficult to change routes. Keep it a hundred with ugly truths like I'm a bastard child. I'm playing but on purpose, nigga, so how you like me now? See, I'm certified hundred, new millennium Benjamin. They call me blue bucks. Get more heads on the sheet than the Ku Klux. I guess... Get more heads under sheets than the Ku Klux. I guess that's why they call me a loose leaf. See, I'm too nuts for y'all to do me. I've been claustrophobic ever since I came out the closet. Too open-minded for boxes. No rotation in my circle. 
No rotation in my circle that makes me nauseous. See, we stand still and let the world revolve around us. You should take your time and study me like the Bible, the Odyssey, and Iliad. In order to get schooled by me, you need prerequisites. See, I'm not an intellectual poet. I'm an intellect with common sense, and there's no way to make this long story short the way I be stroking with my penmanship. Flow so lyrically retarded if my tongue could dance it would moonwalk forward. Turn bars into bricks to separate from all the brain cells I done built. I swear it's levels to this Tetris kid. Flow so heavy that I always keep a maxi pad to absorb all but the seepage. But you niggas is, but you niggas is spotting you barely leaking. Ultra thin with your lines, boy. Flow so heavy that I always keep a maxi pad to absorb all of the seepage. But you niggas is spotting, you barely leaking. Ultra thin, ultra thin with your lines, boy, that niggas is barely feeling it. Provoke a conscious with your content, nigga. Point blank. Yeah. You want the, you want the. You want the point, but you can, you know what? If you want the rest of that, I got a book, right? I got a book, right? And today is the book release. This is the first time people are able to purchase two books, matter of fact, that's coming out today. Two books. Two books. So. Um, not only am I a poet, I'm an educator, and I believe that when you're a writer, you're educating all the time, right? So as a teacher and as a, a private teacher and coach, this is the journal in which to enhance your writing. So these are writing prompts uh, for those who want to manifest something, want to look at yourself in, the, in a different way. It's called becoming the god of your creation because you are the god of everything that you write. You are in control. So this... It's teaching you how to be in control, how to look at yourself as the God of anything and everything that you do. So these these two books. All right, let's keep it rolling. We still feeling good? All right, now this next song, we're going to switch it up. We're going to take it to relationships. How many people in here was with somebody? It's always like that. It's always every time I be like, who who with they person? They be like, I'm with this son of my bad, you know. It be like that. How many? But where my single people at? Yup, 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 yup. Y'all don't mind Netflix and chill by yourself, don't you? Right? Ain't gotta worry about nobody spoiling anything. Nobody. Nobody asking for anything while you trying to watch your, you know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna hit it, I'm gonna hit it with a little bit of perspective on each side, the fall in the love and then what happens. Is that cool? Yeah. All right. And so in this first piece, you know, where um I'm gonna do a little harmony, harmonizing, all right. And uh, you know, remember, I want you to keep in mind that I'm an artist. <laughs> and I'm sensitive about my yeah. mama, they curse, not me. They curse, not me. Okay. Never thought I'd be falling for you so easily. See, this is at the beginning, you know. Never thought I'd be, thought I'd be falling for you so easily. See, you are so easy, like Sunday morning. Simple like morning stretches, easing the night's tension. See, you are the magnitude of happiness taken for granted. No wonder why I was still wishing. But luckily, the past didn't realize its blessing. Didn't see the precious gift that God had concealed in you. See, you are so beautifully packaged, a gift to me that I will take my time on rapping because I want to explore all of you. See, I want your sweet nectar, your morning dew. I want your venom and your ailments too. See, I want to be your armor. Let me take on whatever pierces you so that it never pierces you again. See, I take on this challenge because you are so easy, like balance. I mean, a perfect 69, the way we are so level-headed. See, whatever is on your brain, I get it. 
when no one else gets it. <laughs> See, that was a double header. <laughs> Get it. <laughs> and if you want the rest of that, you're going to have to buy the book. All right, let's skip. Let's skip. Let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. And then all of a sudden, after you done fell in love and tripped in all in your feelings, then it'd be like, we ain't beneficial. I was just beneficial until you found someone else who could benefit you. Y'all ever, ever felt like that? Yes. Like, like, we ain't beneficial. I was just beneficial until you found someone else who could benefit you. But to my benefit and your regret, there's been an issue. So I stopped giving credit without credentials. If it ain't black or white, I'm going to blow the whistle. I had to be the one to make the calls in my life. I've been the official. Let me, let me tell you this story. <laughs> See, it was all good until I took a trip trying to make something temporary permanent, but I learned at my broken heart's expense that beaches are only good for vacation. That unlike soil, sand will never be a solid piece of earth to build a foundation. See, it's a genuine distraction. It's where Cupid goes for target practice, where good company gets confused with companion, where mishaps happen all in the name of love. Where nobody cares about your broken heart because your heart should have never been exposed to a beach that will play contender. That will, that will make you believe so intensely that this is where you want to be, that they will get you to go hard for them when they still tender. You know got a soft spot for social situations. These beaches will have you believe that it's just entertainment and you believe them because this beach has been everything that you needed, you know, just entertainment. But confused you mistaken a good time for future arrangements, turning this vacay into a staycation, got yourself all in this uh, situation <laughs> that won't ship because a beach is stationed it ain't tripping on any relations. For anything beyond the shore is unsure because nothing outside of their world exists to a beach. Understand that they will not journey past with their heart overseas, so titles stay at bay. Notice how the depths of their oceans they will never face. And if you ever try to explore their ocean floor, they will drown you in their secrets until it sinks in that no one survives their deep end. See, over your dead body, a beach will stay afloat. So try not to interrupt their bliss and perfection. They're not interested in your depression. These beaches will look down on you in your darkest day and wonder why you're not making the beach feel special. See, these beaches are selfish. They got a free state of mind, no logic, just perspective. Even structure is subjective for progression to be built in their view. See, if you always question what is true, then there's no way you can lose, because to a beach, there's nothing more relieving than freedom. They are sound opportunists. You know when other people prosper, they tune in, they ride the wave of whoever cruised in and for the right price, a beach will be all inclusive. So you gotta learn how to take it all down from their storms and the destructions of their hurricanes so you can love them past their letdowns all you want. You can even encourage them to level up but they will never see error in their ways. See, they rather play the 50 because any more than that, they will relinquish too much power. They need their pride to be stroked just to prosper. So do the most and watch a beach stay remote. See, they wanna be seen but never present and get mad when you go ghost. But you knew this. You knew that you were just amused for a beach's amusement. But instead of returning the favor of fun, you were foolish to think that you and this beach could ever be exclusive. But see, this experience made me realize that we all played the beach sometimes creating a scenery that we can take someone else's heart seriously, but the mirror in me no longer wants to play or be played with. See, I realized that beaches aren't made for relationships. They are only good for vacation. That unlike soil, sand will never be a solid piece of earth to build a foundation. So I removed the anchor, set sail, and made a promise at my broken heart's expense to never make anything temporary permanent. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I had to take a sip of water just. 
Hydrate. Hydrate. So, we are down to the last piece, guys. Oh, <laughs> but y'all are beautiful, and I'm glad I was able to rock with you all. Voices and Power is crazy dope, man. Congratulations to everything that you have going on. The vibe is phenomenal. Thanks for everybody who came back in the building. I mean, y'all just make sure the show don't stop, right? That's what I'm talking about. So, um, like I said, if you want to follow me, my name is The Truth, The Poet. You can follow me everywhere at D.A. Truth, D.A. Poet, everywhere. My cash app is The Truth, The Poet. <laughs> you want to make something jingle a little bit, you know, you can help all this out. You know, but a dollar doesn't hurt for a full-time artist. All right? So, this one, this last part of my journey is about chasing after your dreams. Do I have dreamers in here? Okay, all right, so on the, on the way out, if you a dreamer, say, I'm a dreamer. I'm a dreamer. If you a dreamer, say, I'm a dreamer. I'm a dreamer. See, someone asked me, they said truth. How do you keep following your dreams? And I told them, I told them, you got to keep running, running like a barrel's on your back. Keep running, running like a barrel's on your back. Keep running forward. I'm talking tunnel vision, never looking back. Don't let that still night cap your realities. You only see dreams in your sleep. So stay woke. Keep moving and make the vision come true. Stop worrying about why someone else hasn't done it yet and accept the fact that the vision is for you. Even if it has been done, trust that no one can do it quite like you do. See, everyone's got it twisted, thinking they're chasing a dream when really the dream is on a mission haunting you. Whether day or night is taunting you, just take a minute and think about why your visions are more like premonitions. Why every decision made towards it is more like intuition. Why every accident feels like intention. Why every roadblock is really a light bulb telling you to do it different. See, fruition be the reason that the image is so clear that you become scared of the view. Why the outcome of every action taken feels like deja vu. I mean, understand that your steps has already been ordered. You just need your feet to follow suit. And if you still don't believe me, then let these haters be your proof. <laughs> Explain why there are so many people doubting and underestimating you. Realize that if you really were a waste of time, then no one would really be clocking you. But see, they clocks are out and they're watching you because you're something to see. For many eyes stare at a dark sky for a long time, awaiting a shooting star just so they can wish on the success of your dream. So keep running, running like a barrel's on your back. Keep running, running like a barrel's on your back. Keep running forward. I'm talking tunnel vision, never looking back. Don't let that still nightcap your realities. You only see dreams in your sleep. So stay woke in peace. Thank you. Thank you so much. Again, this is the book release, y'all. So if y'all like what y'all heard and y'all think it's dope, please come and see me over here. I'm right over here to this. It's left, all right? All right, y'all be easy. Thank you. Have a blessed evening.